Up next, it's a strawweight matchup between Paige Van Zandt and Jessica Pena. Jessica Pena, coming off what she calls the best training camp of her life. And she's ready to enter the octagon and leave with a victory. This girl has outstanding hand speed, lightning fast punches that come from all angles, and she gets out of the way before you can hit her back. She's one of the most difficult fighters to face in this division. Jessica Panay, back in the octagon. One of the most popular and recognized fighters in the UFC today, Paige Van Zandt, who says her hero is Ronda Rousey. She said without her, I would not be where I am today. In the UFC, I plan to follow her path and make my way to the championship level. Her father was a high school and collegiate wrestler, and she likes to swarm, move forward, and attack. This girl's a very well-rounded fighter. Now, some fighters, they have a specialty, and if they, they're taken out of that specialty, they lose a lot of their effectiveness. Not so with her. She is equally good on the ground as she is standing up. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC strawweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a grappler, holding a professional record of twelve wins, five losses. She stands five feet five inches tall, weigh in at one hundred fifteen pounds. Fighting out of Huntington Beach, California, USA, Jessica Panay. And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a freestyle fighter, holding a professional record of seven wins, two losses. She stands five feet four inches tall, weigh in at 115 pounds. Fighting out of Sacramento, California, 12 gauge Paige Bassett. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. Mario Yamasaki, our referee for this strawweight battle. And go, here go. we go. Fight scheduled for three five minute rounds. White trunks for Panay, black trunks for Van Zandt. What started with Ronda Rousey is now a very deep roster of talented female fighters who battle in the octagon. Their skill sets continue to become more impressive, and the compete level that these women bring every single time is absolutely amazing. The women go to battle, they put on a show, and they leave it all in the octagon. Good uppercut. Up nice, oh, nice leg kick. Drops down for a double. Van Zandt with a solid takedown. Good sweep. She's in the half guard. She's now in half guard again. That connected. And now she's got full mount. She's going for that arm. Almost had the arm bar. Big Huge elbow. elbow to the head. She moves into the back mount. Vicious hammer fist. Wow. There he goes. Back to mount, mount again. Penny, he's got the back again. Nice. Half guard here. Lands a good shot from the bottom. 
excellent movement and transitions here on the ground, staying busy. She moves into north-south. She's in half guard now. That's a nasty elbow. Strong right by Penny. Now able to posture up. Look Good at elbow. that elbow again. Yeah. Yep. Under a minute now. Big punch. Just 45 seconds remain in the round. She's able to get the fight back to full guard. He's trying to take the back here. 15 seconds. Oh, Vicious that's left, left, hand. left hand. Wow! They are on their feet! Here's a nasty ground and pound strike. And here is another ground and pound strike. And here's another powerful ground and pound strike. There was some really good ground and pound in that round. There's the beautiful Brittany as we get set for round two. Round two. Comes out swinging. Man, that cut is getting worse. Van Zant with the jab. Huge block. That was a big kick to the body. Change of stance. Beautiful jab. Joe, there we see our total strikes landed so far. Goes for a single. Unbelievable. Beautiful takedown. In half guard now. Transitions to full guard. Reversal and into half guard. Wow, Beautiful that's a big hand. left hand. Trying to pass here. She's inside control. Full guard here. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Good jab by Van Zandt. Nice hook to the body. That's a takedown. Oh, that's, a, that's a huge takedown. Moves to half guard. That eye swole up so quick, Mike. You gotta wonder whether or not that's a fractured orbital. And there's a reversal. Full guard now. Back to half guard now. Van Zant with a good punch. Postured up. Oh, that's a nice right hand. That connected. And now she gets her back. 45 seconds remain in the round. Postures up. Beautiful left hand. timing with the left hand. Oh, that's good a good shot. shot right there. Very good shot. What a way to work at the finish of this round. Last round coming up. You got five minutes. I want you to go out there and finish this fight. 
Let's put you. Here we see a perfectly timed kick. Connects flush. And here we see a perfectly executed suplex. And here you see excellent technique and a big slam. Ariani. Perry there. Good straight punch. And another strike lands. Nice leg kick by Van Zandt. Good connection with the straight by Penny. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. A lot of work in the clinch in this one. Got over and under here. She's got the tie clinch here. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. That knee connects. Oh, good knees, Joe. Tying up in the clinch here. That's it. Gets the takedown. Three minutes left in the fight. Great movement on the ground. Oh, beautiful sweep. Man, both of her eyes have started to swell very badly. You've got to wonder about her vision. Joe, she's staying busy on top. Oh! It is all That's it. over! Tremendous hook on the button for the win. Joe, here's the finish on our fight replay. And let's look at the replay and see the end of this fight. This is the huge ground and pound strike that lands for the KO. Let's look at that from a different angle. Check it out here. Bam! Lights out. Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 23 seconds of round number 3. Declaring the winner by knockout, 12 Gage, Paige Van Zandt. Paige Van Zandt wins by knockout.